Uh, Vine and Wine Wednesdays is something that we do every Wednesday, um, 5.30, as long as the, the venue's available. <coughs> um, I've been doing it for, for over a year now. It's just a free tasting on a, on a Wednesday afternoon, and it's um, just me showcasing different uh, different things. So it may be that I do uh, a selection from a producer. Uh, last night, for example, I showed 2014 vintage wines. Some of the new vintages are coming out from uh, in, in whites. So particularly, um, Jeffrey Grosset has just released his new Rieslings. Uh, so I wanted to show, one of the questions that people ask me is, What's the, what's the current vintage like? So, uh, so I showed that last night so, so that people could have a look at what, um, what the new vintage is like, actually, because it's 2014 or 2014 ones. But um, I've also done things where um, I've done a blending uh, afternoon, so that, that means just for an hour. Uh, I had a winemaker send up barrel samples of, of wine. Um, from the different single sites that before they blended to make the final product and then actually giving them to the customer to say, have some fun with it, blend your own wine and see and see what you come up with. Because um, it's not just a case of um, just uh, the, the winemaker presses some grapes and then sticks it in the bottle and there you have wine. I mean, there's a lot of processes that go through that. Um, so I wanted to show that. Also did a, an afternoon just recently on, on wine faults and floors, so that when um, if you go to a restaurant and there's not a sommelier working, or if uh, or if you think that you've got a faulty wine, what could possibly be, be wrong with it? Because I know that a lot of people talk about cork taints and uh, oxidation and everything like that. I'm not sure that everyone knows exactly what that what that is. Um, so yeah. if you say a bottle of wine's corked, you might actually mean it's oxidised or it's cooked. Or, or whatever, so there are different faults and flaws that can be there. So I did, I collected wines for about three months and I put that together and, and then just showed what, what the actual faults and flaws are. So it um, gives um, the customers a few more tools when they're, when they're talking to people in a restaurant.